Hi there, I'm Jean. I'm just going to do a bit of placing and chatting with you. Anyone's there, you can join me. Join me. All right, there you go. It's going to be a bit awkward with the bio books. Got about that. Keep it up there. And there, right. Um, there you go. Look, best thing to do with these, because you can only put them on the painting one way, otherwise they're hard to get off. I always put a little sticky label there, so I know that's not the side to put to the painting. Okay, just a little uh, bit of advice there. Right, well, before we get started on that, uh, this is a notebook that I've done a long, long time ago. Now, I just, <coughs> excuse me. Just ordered this. Okay. Haven't tried it yet. Well, I'm oh, if I can open it. I have had it open, so oh, I don't know why. That's it. Uh, it says to put on very thinly and with a small brush. I'm going to try this brush. <coughs> Excuse me. <coughs> Take the access off. I'll point this downwards a bit and I'll hold the book up. See what happens. I'm only going to try it in one place because it's supposed to be clear, just a dry clear. But uh, I don't want to take any chances. I did try this and I tried that was a, on this one down here. No, it hasn't done too bad. But we'll see what this one comes out like. If that's all right, I shall use that for sealing. Mind you, as I say, <coughs> excuse my voice, <coughs> I've done this a long time ago and it hangs about on my coffee table and they've all been fine. None of them has fell off. So hopefully <laughs> they'll be okay. Right. <coughs> I don't know if anyone was watching yesterday. I don't think they was. <clears throat> but I done this yesterday as well, and um, I ran out of the the white stones, whatever you call them, white stones. And um, lucky enough, I had some from a, probably from the book. Oh, that's not the one. Left over, so I used some of those and managed to finish it off on that bit. Now, yesterday, what was I doing yesterday? I don't, I've done the pink, done part of that on the camera. Um, right, what should we do? Number three is that one, right? Where's well, number three? Um, two packets. Oh, no. That's number three. What's that one? It's the same colour by the looks of it. That's number four. So there must be a slight difference. Right, scissors. And this is the first time I've gone live, so you must forgive me if I do anything wrong or I think I'm silly. I am silly, so I did say that to my granddaughter a lot. Silly now. Like we was going down the um, post office Wednesday, because I usually have one on Wednesdays, and um, got halfway there, realised I didn't have a mask with me. So we had to turn back and get it. <clears throat> I just said to her, Nanny silly. Well, Nana silly, actually. Right, uh, number three, make sure it's the right one. Yeah, there you go. I hope my head's not in the way. I wish I could bring it closer without moving the computer, but I'm not sure how to do that. Live and learn. not very good is it mind you i thought that yesterday when i was um, doing it but when i watched the video back it was okay it was clear i mean you could see so i'm hoping that's the case this time but it's not really helpful for me having to do it sideways but until i get me have a tripod
Well, excuse me, not very nice, is it, doing that on camera? As this is my first time going live, I'm not going to be on for very long. As I suggested, I'm not sure where this one's from, because I think it's before I started writing them in my book. Um... There is a butterfly in here. Whether it's this one or not, I don't know. But that was £7.84, so I don't think so. I think I might have got this one from Wish, but I'm not 100% sure. Oops, I didn't pick it up. Silly me. Anyone got any advice for me? I'd much appreciate it. If I can make it better for viewers, that would be great. Just trying to make sure I don't get me in the way. But if I turn it... on this table. Sorry, I'm just trying to pull you a bit nearer. As you can see, I'm working on the stain. Hang on, this is it. And oops. Oh dear, I'm not going very well here, am I? Where does it come off? Right, try again. There you go. And I'm working on a light bulb. Let's try doing it this way, maybe. You might be able to see a bit better without me getting the hand in the way. asking me anything yet? Just took my dogs out a little while ago and just got back in time before it poured down. <clears throat> white stones, um, one stones. I had a lot of wastage. Um, so whether, whether that was why I didn't have enough, I don't know, but to be honest, even, um, I'm lost. I've, even if I hadn't, I just, them weight, all so much wasted, I still don't think there would have been enough. But I have plenty of the pink. Why did I miss that one? And it looks like I've got plenty of this colour as well. I was really reluctant to do this one, but I'm quite enjoying it actually. 
was suggested it. I think it's because it was a partial, a very partial. And uh, I do like the full ones more than anything. Well, it looks funny. Oh, I didn't put it on then. There you go. Oh, do you mind if I have a drop of my drink? My cup of tea? It's actually um, licorice and peppermint tea. Not all to do with tea. A lot of change now and then. Oh, come on, pick up. Pick up, pick up, pick up. <clears throat> Oops. You're swinging on it. <clears throat> I've also got a um, Facebook page. I forgot now. Um, I think that's just called Jean's Diamond Paint Art Paintings. <clears throat> I've actually paid a couple of times to have it boosted, which I've got lots and lots of views. There, but then I don't think there's anything anywhere on there that you can subscribe to it. I wish I'd know how to do it on YouTube. I'd um, pay to have it boosted. As long as it wasn't too expensive. Because I'm a pensioner, so I can't afford too much. I'm just going to drink some more my tea. Because it is rather cold now. Keep losing where I've got to. There I am. Silly me. I was saying yesterday, um, my daughter usually edits my diamond art, my videos for me. And um, the last one she tried to edit it, the voice just was gobbledygook. Excuse me, so she couldn't do it. So as soon as we figure out what's going wrong, we will do it. Because I managed to edit one. Um, a while back, and the voice on that was just gobbledygook, and you couldn't even see anything, just lots and lots of lines. So, I don't know what's going on. Oh, it's still pouring with rain. I tell you what, I've got a pool out in my garden, it's only a 10 foot round one. When I've had them before, I've always packed them up, put them away for the winter and um, got them out again, cleaned them out in the summer and put them up. So this time, because I'm getting old now, I decided not to put it away because I have to put it up on my own as well. Um, I decided to leave it up and I emptied the water out, just left a little bit in the bottom, cleaned it put some more water in the bottom, put some bleach in it. And because um, we had some nice weather and wasn't getting any rain for a while, it started getting empty, especially on one side because it's not straight at the moment. <clears throat> and uh, since it's been raining, it's, it's got a few inches of water in there now. So... So in the summer, I just have to empty it out, clean it, and um, 
fill it up again. Hopefully we'll have some nice weather. So I can use it again. Mind you, I think I might have to get a ladder for it because uh, I'm all right now. I can get in and out of it. As I'm getting older, I probably won't be able to. And it is nice to cool down when it's really hot. Getting old is no good, is it? I mean, I was watching, um, it was, I think it's Rambling Rose last night. I did fall asleep in the end, as I usually do. Um, but she was showing about the rulers. And I've got two, the one round and one, one for round diamond drills and one for um, square. I've only used it once, the round one. And it started off really, really nice. Nice, straight and everything. But as I went over further and further, and I moved it over and done some more, it started to come out of place. And in the end, the drills were going where they shouldn't be going. So I had to stop using it. So that was a bit disappointing. But um, I didn't know until I watched Rose that <clears throat> they make them different sizes for, for different paintings. So I've got to find out about that because I, oh, I ain't got a clue. I haven't been doing this for very long, so but you know, I was I was watched plenty of other people doing their diamond art paintings and it's handy because they tell you things you don't know. So um when I first started, I didn't even know you had to put this stuff in your pen. And I'm trying to pick up the drills and couldn't do it and I couldn't figure out why so in the end I had to go and watch diamond painting because I hadn't watched any videos till then and that's how I found it because there was no instructions with the diamond painting I got either no like there is here but um yeah so I went online and had a look and see how it was done and that's what started me off watching people doing diamond paintings. So, um, and then I thought, why not do some videos myself? So that's what I did. I started doing the videos. <clears throat> but I'm a very, I do like lots of crafts. But there are trouble is with me, I can't do them all. At the same time, um, I started off a few years back making headbands, children's headbands, and um, sold a few. And quite enjoyed doing that. And then I started seeing videos of um, jewellery being made. And I thought, I want to get into that. So I got into jewellery making, got lots and lots of beads and stuff I need and tools. Done that for years. I've got loads and loads and loads of jewellery that I've made that I've um, tried to sell now and then. Not had much luck yet, though. I've sold a few things from where um, I used to work. And then diamond painting come up. So I thought... So now I've got into diamond paintings, so I'll keep all the new more and more diamond paintings. But I have gone back and done a bit of jewellery. I made some earrings the other week. And that one's no good, is it? It's got the flat side is where the, the colour is, so that's no good at all. <clears throat> I'm going to have to write notes down because there's things I think of telling you. But when I'm actually on doing the videos, I forget what they are. So I just have to start making lists. So any... Uh, Advice would be greatly accepted and welcomed.
from doing, you know, not doing something properly. Let me know. Oh, I've got any advice of how I can get my videos out? People watching them better? I'd be much obliged. See there. All right. This one dropped. Where was I now? See, I'm lost. Oh, I'm lost. Oh, I'm Oh, what am I doing? Thinking it's my tablet, and it's not. Excuse me again. Oh, can you hear that rain? Really coming down. Oh, I've been doing a bit of DIY this morning. Bought a couple of new shelves for my uh, bathroom, going to shower. Um, I had two in there, plastic ones, and they got broken. Uh, well, one got broke when my partner was putting a new shower. Up. And um, so I bought a couple of glass shelves and uh, I put them up this morning, made the right hash of it, but done it in the end. And then the other, the other day I put a drill hole in the wall for a socket, an uh, extension socket. It used to be up, but when I decorated, one of the uh, screws and um, wall plugs fell out. So I filled the hole. And when I went to put it back up, I'd done a template and everything. But I couldn't get the socket back up. It seemed the, um, the screws were too far out. So today... I've moved it, put another hole in the wall, and uh, I've got it out. So pleased with myself. Useless I am, things like that. I used to do a lot of it. I actually done a carpentry course when I was quite a few, bit, quite a bit, quite a bit younger. But um, I stopped doing all DIY when I met my partner twenty odd years ago. And let him take over. But now he can't do it. So I've got to go back to doing it. So I'm just trying to cover the white bit up. Anybody on yet? There. It's a butterfly. You not see it? Butterfly.
just a simple butterfly, diamond painting. Which, um, I just look them up on sites and if I like them, I buy them if I can. Uh, it's nice to have you on, welcome. Please subscribe to my channel. Oh, I see what you mean. No, I just bought it. But I don't think it means anything. Uh, I've got a couple of butterflies, so, um, yeah. Hope you're enjoying my channel, my silly chat. I don't know how long I've been on here. I expect it tells you somewhere. Oh yeah, 26 minutes. What do you do? Do you do any um, diamond paintings or anything else? Um, oh, sorry, I can't read your first name. Yeah, I've only been doing it a few months. You do ordinary painting or, you know, I don't mean ordinary, I mean like paints or this sort of painting. You're from Sweden. Oh, lovely. Welcome. Lovely. I'm afraid I'm not. I'm not very arty in that way. Uh, it's hobby with me. Um, I used to do um, cross stitch. I've done embroidery in the past, um, but cross stitch and the embroidery is a bit beyond my eyes at the moment. <laughs> now I'm getting old. You start losing your. Uh, even though I've got glasses, you start losing the sight and you really need bright, really, really brightness, a lot of brightness to do anything like that. Where this is, because you can use a light bulb as well, it makes it a lot better. Oh, I've lost that. I mean, I keep losing where I am. Do you watch a lot of Um, you can hear me, can't you? I should think so. Otherwise, I'll write it. Thank you for watching me. I'm in England, by the way, um, Essex in England. Well, 
I'm just going to finish this mauve line off and then close down. Oh, why do I keep losing where I am? That's my last one, guys, for now. Thank you for watching. Please like, some subscribe, and share. It would be lovely. Hope to see you again soon. Bye.